Oh, double kill. I hope I've got enough bullets for this. <laughs> yeah. Guys, welcome back to Scum. We've just come out of the C2 bunker and we are going into explore mode today. I just want to head down quickly and see if I can have a look at this area before we sort of head up into the mountains and eventually I think we're going to head up to D0 because um, a few of you are wanting to see what is actually up there. But um, before we before we get going, before we start, I just wanted to say a little thank you to uh, to all of you who have been um, sort of appreciating the content, liking the content, and um, I think we need to turn up here. Just appreciating and uh, hitting that like button and everything like that. I can't thank you enough for uh, for doing so. It means a lot to me. It means a lot to the channel. Um, you know, obviously. If a lot of people hit the like button, um, it certainly helps the algorithm pick it up and more people get to view the content, and hopefully they will like it too. Um, ooh, oh man, look at all these zombies already. Oh, is that a motorbike up there? That is a motorbike. No, I'm not going to bother. I'm not going to bother with it. We have our car. <laughs> Besides, you can't, you can't ride a motorbike that well on snow. Trust me, I have tried one time. Never again. <laughs> Never again. It's always been car for me now. And in fact, I had a I had a Mercedes was a um, rear wheel drive car, and even that was just ridiculous um, to go. Uh, we are definitely going the right way, yeah. Oh man, so much fun having a rear wheel drive car in snow. Love it, but it is so not practical. Literally. It's not practical at all. The whole time you spend driving it, it's the dashboard sort of lights up with the, all the, um, you know, those, I don't know, you know, those um, EMCs. It. You have loads of different um, traction controls. You have different um, computers on board that actually help <laughs> um, the car just be stable. Ooh, this is the radio tower. I quite like the radio tower. The last time we were here, we didn't have very much in terms of... Uh, oh man, this is... Eek. <laughs> we didn't have much gear. Let's just turn around here quickly. Right, I think we're going to have to park up. Quickly get out. These guys, as far as I'm aware, can get through the fence. Yeah, there he goes. There they all go. They'll be coming through that fence over there somewhere. There they are. One down. Two down. Oh, I got him. No, I didn't. <laughs> oh, double kill. I hope I've got enough bullets for this. <laughs> yeah! Okay. I love this gun, guys. Is he gonna go? Yeah, he's gone. We're in. Bring it on. Let's use our axe. Oh, I knocked him out! Give him a slap! <laughs> oh, he hit me! Give him some space. I didn't give him enough space. He hit me, but I'm still 100%. 0% blood loss. Okay, we're all good. Ooh, there's one down there. He's not noticed me yet. Hello. Are you guarding anything good? Come on, then. He's a bit. Oh, man! Duck! Dive, dodge, dip, and duck! Ah, <laughs> oh, in the face! Got him. Got him that time. I tell you what, can we. Is there any stones or anything on the floor here? Maybe I can throw something out. Oh! It's a crossbow. Let's take the crossbow. 
can I throw this? <laughs> you can't throw paper, surely. If it, I don't know. Should we give it a go? Maybe we can throw that. Do you know what? I'm, oh, a rebar cutter. What is this? What is this doing <laughs> in the desk like this? Do you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay, shove this in the car quickly. Let's go put it in the car. Or I'll tell you what, let's just fill it up. Fill up the car. Fill fuel. Fuel, go. Top it up. Rebar cutter in, that can go in. Can you throw this? You cannot throw it. Let's see. I'm gonna test to see if you can throw this. Camera lens. Yes! <laughs> oh, it's bringing them both in. Oh, it's not actually. Screw it. Let's just go straight in. Oh. He's taking a nice big hit. Right. I'm going to try not to get too close. Oh, he still, even though he took a shot, he still took a few. A few hits. There's another crossbow. Um, leather pistol holder. That nah, I'm not. I'm not too much of a fan of that, to be honest. I'll take the uh, the hunter ammo. Ooh, and the AKS 74U. Right, that's 24 percent. No, I'm not going to bother. We already picked one up. My character seems to be getting a little bit cold. Let's just keep going. I'm going to check ammo before we go. 13. Oh! Wait! Wait, 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 wait. Was this the quad bike that we left? It is the quad bike that we left. Ooh, got a bayonet there as well. I'm going to take that too. Do you know what? No, I've got 20 out of 20 on that one. Sweet! It's got food. Flare. Excellent. Let's just get rid of this guy before he rushes me. Right, let's check this stuff. That motorbike was like... That quad bike. It was like a, our personal storage. Ooh. Look at that. We'll sell that in a bit. Maybe it'll keep our face warm. <laughs> but guys, I tell you what. I would love it if you guys um, could hit that like button. But also, I would love it if you guys could comment. Tell me what you guys like seeing. Um, tell me how you guys like me playing. Let me know if you find, if you see something and I missed it. Oh, look, there's some more pink boots. I'm definitely taking those as a spare. Military cap, we don't need that. But if everybody commented and told me a little bit about what you like, or a comment about, oh, did you see that? Or did you see this? Do you like this? Or whatever. It'll be awesome to have that communication from you guys. I'd love to see that because uh, ultimately I love hearing about you guys. I love appreciating some of your comments. I do try to respond to pretty much all of them. Um, we're a small channel at the moment, so I get the luxury of being able to um, reply to pretty much everybody's comments. So, if you want, uh, if you want communication, interaction from me, you know what to do. Right, let's crack on. What have we got here? Uh, ACP ammo. We're going to take that. Military top. I might take that as well, actually. Quite like a military top. I can hear someone running around. Probably me making a hell of a lot of noise, attracting them, searching through some of this stuff. Ooh, we'll take the MP5 magazine. Not gonna, bleh. not gonna bother with that. 22 ammo. We don't need it. We don't use the 22. Right, last one. Excellent. That's that done. Let's close this before we, before people spawn in there. 
don't need that stuff. Just a beer here. If I can. Right, there's nobody in here. There's definitely people outside though. Ooh, two lots of ACP ammo. Fresh box. Well, it definitely wasn't a fresh box, was it? <laughs> Man, they sound close. How close do they sound there? But they're just there, like... By the way, guys, I've turned up the volume on the, uh, the game. So hopefully everything's going to be a little bit louder. Let me know what you think. Is it loud enough? Take that. Let's just check these. Ooh, some more hunter ammo. Right, here we go. Just the one? I've got a few boxes here to search. Well, he just came through the wall, didn't he? They haven't even seen me yet. Let's keep searching through this nice, nice good loot. I think this is a food hall. See anything, guys? I see nothing. Let's check the kitchen. To think they used to cook in this place. Look at the hygiene rating of zero. Ooh, cleaver. Now I'm gonna stick with my axe. Hang on. Food. No food portion? Oh yes, there is. It's only an apple. Apples are good for you. Just swapping around my inventory space there. How many ammo? How many bullets have we got left? Four. I think it's time to reload, do you not think? There's a few people up there. There's one. There's another one just there. Wait, what was that? Ah, pear compot. Let's quickly check the stuff. Before we get in there, I'm right, just gonna check this side quick. Don't forget to check these things, guys. Sometimes you have a weapon laying on top there. You see, they've changed these things around now, which is so cool. What's in here? Right, nothing special. Shut this door quickly. And this one. Ooh! What are you hiding? Just jeans. Oh! Straight in the chest that was. Right, there's going to be a few people in here. Seem to be making some good progress here. Right, how many were upstairs? There's one. Oh, he came rapidly. Nothing good in there. Richard's cheese! Dick's cheese! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, she's down. Let's check these quickly. See if there's anything we got. I might take that. Hello. There's more in here. I think he's in this one. 
Ooh, did I see some crackers on the desk there? Let's go get the crackers. Uh, not after we have a drink first. Look at this blue top, guys. I love this blue top. I, I don't know what it is about the blue top. I love it. In PvP mode, yeah, not so good. But uh, <laughs> in single player, when nobody nobody can spot you or kill you or whatever. Yeah, it's good. Love it. Love this top. It just looks so cool. And the way that's fitted as well. Awesome. Lots of metal there. Um, getting a bit cold. Shut that door. Let's check upstairs. I think we pretty much woke up everybody here. So last time we were here, we were like looking for a battery, and we were looking for um, fuel and all that stuff, and so far we found two fuel sources. Nuts. Do you know what, actually, we could probably, we could probably take that stuff. We could actually probably take that stuff to the, um, where was it? That wasn't in here, because I haven't searched this stuff yet. Maybe we can take that to the quad. Where's that stuff? Is it in here? I can't remember now. Is it in here? No. That one? No. Next one? No. Uh, yeah, there it is. Right, let's shove this in our hands quickly. Maybe we'll just go put that in the quad quickly. Save it for the next time. I mean, we could, we could despawn it. Ooh. Take the slugs. We could despawn this, uh, or wreck it, or whatever. But, um, oh, we've already got fuel in it. This thing just needs battery now. I remember now! I remember we had a tiny bit of battery. We did have a tiny bit of battery. It didn't, um, it just wasn't enough, though. Right, let's get into the next section. In fact, did we have any batteries in here? I don't. I can't remember if there was any batteries in here. I don't think there was. Sun's getting low. There's a few, uh, a few searchables over here quickly. Oh, my character needs to pee. Let's take a quick pee. Oh, and a poo. That's the last thing you want to do when you're freezing. Take your trousers off. Take a take a pee in, a, in snow. Oh man, she must be freezing her bits off. <laughs> Ooh. Are you gonna give me some uh, some good treats or anything? Yes, you are. A banana. A pooey banana. Which I'm probably gonna eat. It's got skin, right? So it's all good. <laughs> you guys are disgusting. Eat. Eat it. Eat that, sh that shit banana. <laughs> oh, there's a zombie up there. Oh, hello. Might as well, might as well get in. Oh, we're in the kitchen. Got some food. Bread. Gigantic loaf of bread. Oh, some African biltong! Jeez, oh, sounds close. Alright, here's a window. Let's have a look. I don't know where they are. I think they might be in here. Or they might be underneath me. I don't know. Let's get in. We're in, guys. One in here? No. I hear lots of footsteps on snow. We all know what that means. It might be ditched underneath us. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. Right. Nothing in here. What if you can search this wardrobe? No. Can search. Search the desk though.
Is there anything else in the kitchen? Let's just check. I don't really need any food. Tomato, though, I'll take. I do love a good tomato. It's so good for you. Ooh, double bang firecracker. I'm going to take that. Should we use it? Ugh. That was gross, man. Uh, we went in there. In the face. Anyone else? Got some money? Just a bit of money? It would be so cool to have like a proper radio station there, wouldn't it? I mean, I know that there is a radio station. Oh, some money. I'll take the money. Yeah, there's a radio station that you guys can listen to. I don't know if you guys know. Um, I can't remember what the, the name of it is, though. It's like Scum FM or something. <laughs> it's quite good, actually, if you guys haven't heard it. Grab yourself a radio and um, try it out. Old CDs. Nothing that we want in here. Let's check these boxes quickly. Mobile phone. Just a couple of tapes and things. Okay, I think we're done in this little bit. Now, are these guys going to come through the wall? Oh, they sound so close, don't they? I'm telling you, they are underneath me. And I'm pretty sure they're going to come through the wall if I go down here. How much ammo we got? 11. <laughs> Let's go! There he is! Just you? Anyone else? I think that's it. <laughs> it's just the one guy. Alright guys. That's awesome. We can go on to the next the next spot. It's funny how much quicker you can do it when you have a decent weapon. Here we go. Shut this door so that everybody can stay, <laughs> stay within the walls. Right, let's just get some of this stuff in the car though. Uh, what do we got? Yeah, we've got a whole bunch of space in here. That's, that's absolutely cool. Put this stuff in there. Um, that. I just... Ooh, listen to them all. Sell that. Probably sell that. That can go into weapons and bolt on can come with me. Let's put all the stuff in weapons. We did have the shotgun. Yep. <laughs> that just happened. Uh weapons. Uh that can go into there. Ooh, you guys probably want to see me light that bad boy. We'll take this and the bolt tongue and that can go in there. To be fair, all this all this good stuff can pretty much go in. Uh, we might use that and we'll sell that. Okay, we've got two flares, but only two flares. Okay, sweet. Let's get the stuff back in here. Onward. Okay. So we've done the C2 bunker. Let's head deeper into C2, the north of C2. Here we go. Right. Without crashing too much, <laughs> let's see if I can make it down. Um, but guys, I tell you what, something you guys could comment on is uh, tell me how eager and keen you are to, to have the new update of 0.8. Sounds like there's a, a light at the end of the tunnel. Um, uh, where, where are we going? We could probably skip across here to be honest. Cut out a bit of time. Um, I'm deadly looking forward to uh, 0.8. I can't wait, generally. Um, genuinely can't wait. It's gonna be so good. Whoa. Hang on. Where's that road? Okay, we're coming up. Oh, that was 
Yeah, I, that that happened. Right, keep going. I need to go pretty much straight this way. Oh, I'm gonna wreck my car if I keep doing that. Right, follow the road. Follow the road, follow the road around. Go straight back past the bunker. North we go. Sort of towards that way. I love the snowy biome, there's just something about it. Apart from the whole sort of driving aspect being really, really hard, it's uh, it's, it's so fun up here, guys. Right, let me just see. Um, we kind of want to go uh, sort of up this way, don't we? Just explore a little bit more. Right, so we're going to take a left here in a minute. Keep following that road. To keep going towards this way. This is the way. What's that though? Should we check it out? I tell you what, I might just park the car here to be honest. There's going to be puppets in here, isn't there? Yes. Just the one. Is that going to bring in more? I saw one jump. Are they coming around? Oh, they're coming around. Okay, that's them. That's them dealt with. Nice and quick. Double tap. <laughs> Ooh! Fire helmet! Did you hear that? That's a wolf. Right, what else have we got in here? Anything good? Could search this one. See if she's got anything on her. Got a fire helmet! That's, that's awesome. Ooh! 60 bucks! Take that as well. Replace the one that we absolutely annihilated. Do you know what? Do you know what? Do you know what? I might take those. Where's those? That gear, plastic scissors, plastic scissors? Is that what it says? Plastic scissors. They give us so much more um, rags when we want them. Shark might use this instead. Have we got anything good in here? No, nothing good in here. Let's take the batteries though. Oh, I thought that was a shotgun then. Now, what about this side? Is it absolutely nothing? Were they literally just... They were just all stood outside the perimeter. Sweet. That's that done. <gasps> Big jump. Look at that sun setting. It's really nice. It's going to get a whole lot better in a minute. Hopefully catch it before the episode ends. Right, round we go. Back onto the road so we don't absolutely annihilate our car. Let's have a look and see what's around here. We'll just use this road until we come up against something. It's rare that I come up this road. Oh, wait, is this a safe zone? Is this the safe zone? I can't remember. I think this is the safe zone. If you guys haven't been to the safe zone yet, you guys are in for a little bit of a treat. Now, I'm not entirely sure. I'm not entirely sure if there's any puppets in here. <laughs> Can you guys hear that? It's like a bar area. But what I'm going to do quickly is I'm going to turn the volume down a little bit. Let me just, sorry, I just. Maybe it's, is it music? I'm going to turn the master volume down because it gets really loud. It gets really, really loud. I'm pretty sure you can go in there, but let me just explore this little bit up here. Do you know what? Has this good place got any loot? Whoa! Pop 
pirate, a pirate hat, not a party hat. Right, is there any more puppets in here? <laughs> right, let's just go up here quickly. Now I wonder, can you actually get in this one? I think you probably can as well. Okay, we've got some offices. Okay, so this stuff is still searchable. Here we go. Downstairs is where it's at. You guys are in for a little bit of a treat. Uh, yeah, not, <laughs> not that way. This way. So... Have you guys ever been to an underground rave? This is pretty much it. Do you know what this feels like to me? This feels like when you go down, it feels like almost like the Matrix where they have to go underground and the machines are after them. <laughs> Check this out. It's loud though. It's really loud. and things so cool this game is such a community game right online if you got your mates you can you know meet up at the rave area so good anyway let's just check what else has this place got to offer these towers do they have anything in them let's have a look I mean I'm pretty low on energy right now hopefully I'll make it up to the top before <laughs> Hopefully I don't pass out. Oh, there is some ammo up here. And some some antlers. We could go around checking all the towers and probably come up with some decent loot. But let's get let's get some of our stamina back quickly, guys. Let's see let's see what else this place actually has to offer. I might go into there actually. That might those places there might have some some ammo and uh, weaponry and stuff in them. Right down we go. Right, where's those stairs? There. Oh man, looks like we got a bit of cloud there. We're not gonna be able to see our sunset. Okay, nothing in here. Nothing of value. Take that though. Anything in this one? Just gonna check through the window. Nah, nothing. So there's a. Oh no. I just hurt my leg. Right, so here's the arena. It's like a UFC arena or something. <laughs> this is so cool. There is, there it is. There's blood on the floor. Oh, am I going to add to the blood? Yes, I'm adding to the blood. <laughs> oh, amazing. Shut that before the zombie spawns in it. Right, is there anything around here? On the stands that we can nab? <laughs> no, nothing, unfortunately. There is another tower over here. Let's quickly check this out. This one's a big tower. Don't jump down. <laughs> Don't jump down. That's that's gonna be 
stupid if I do. Right, anything in here? Can't see anything. No, nothing. Nothing whatsoever. Alright guys, this is a safe zone, just so you know. I mean we did we did face a puppet as soon as we uh as soon as we got in here, but um You know, we did have to open something to get in there. Right, let's just check in here. Anything in here? No? Can't get in that one? No. It's almost like a repair station, isn't it? Right, we're running out of stamina fast. Okay. Let's continue our journey up. I can't want to go this road here. So we need to head towards the east. I think that's gonna be that's gonna be the journey we go. Come on, stamina. Just need enough to get to the car, let's go. Do we have any more ammo for this gun whatsoever? No. Oh well. East, that way. Pretty sure that road curves off to the right. But there you go. You guys have seen the safe zone, the rave zone, party zone. If there's something else at this place that I've missed, you guys tell me about it. Did I miss something? I don't tend to spend uh, that much time up there. Wait, have I taken the right route? Yes, I think I have. I don't. I never tend to spend much time in there, um, sort of exploring and stuff. So, uh, if there's something else in there that I missed, let me know. But for now, let's keep heading towards that sort of east, north and east. Big drift. <laughs> oh, it's, why is it so much fun to drift in this car? But knowing me, I'm going to stack it somewhere. Yeah, oh, yeah, like almost there. Like now. Oh, that was so close. I had you guys fooled. I had you guys fooled that I was going to be crashing that car. It's a good thing I've got loads of uh, repair kits. <laughs> we all know my driving is terrible. Right, what have we got here? We've got a little town. Town with puppets. Yeah, screw it, let's get out. Big one, needs two. Six bullets. We're going here. Oh, he needs two. Shut this door quickly. What have we got in the barrels? Anything good in the barrels? Any food or anything? Some lead plates. Right, is that is that a bullet done? Yeah, one bullet left. Oh, missed it. Damn it. Oh, do not shoot at the car. I thought I hit the uh, the tyre then. Okay, nothing nothing else here worth looting. Let's see what we got. Is there anything good in here? Is that an axe on the floor over there? That's a spade. Just picked up the spade. Can we dig a hole? Dig a hole, anyone? Oh, pity. Now, one of the things that I've not actually done in this, and you guys might be able to help me in this, is how the hell do you do bury a chest? Do you have to sort of right-click on the chest? Do you have to put a chest down and then bury the chest? Hang on, where's my car? <laughs> Let's try this out. I've never tried to do this. Just never, never needed to. No, just do it, Perry. Ooh, 
Ooh. I've just never tried this before, guys. Okay, figuring things out as we go. Here I am, <laughs> burying some loot. I want to see what it looks like. I've done it on the damn road as well. This is where I lose my loot. I can't find out where it is. Oh, am I going to run out of stamina? I'm going to run out of stamina! Oh, I've run out of stamina! Oh no, there we go. He's taking a rest. So she... Oh, there we go. Alright, there we go. My loot is buried. <laughs> I mean, it's a pretty big mound, to be fair, though. What happens if you drive over it? This is fully experimentation. <laughs> Let's give this a go. Oh shit, where did it go? Oh no, it's still there. Okay, alright. Fair enough. It doesn't actually do do anything. You don't, you know. Right, let's unbury it. Oh, it takes a long time. Oh, did you see that lightning? Lightning and thunder. Oh man, I'm down to low stamina now. This is quite interesting. I've never tried this before. So you have to you have to sort of like right click on the item you want to bury and then bury it. I like it. It's not that obvious in the snow though, is it? At all. I mean obviously I buried it in the road. It's yeah, totally obvious there, but when I went a little bit further on, you could not see it. If you were to pick a spot like out here in the woods, no one would find that, I'm sure. Absolutely no one. Can you imagine? Right, let's pop this in here. Get that in there too. Yeah, I know you're tired. I know you're tired. You're resting. Okay, we're continuing on our route. But I think what we need to do... I think we need to continue the route in the next episode. It's getting dark. The storm's brewing. The storm's coming in. I think we're going to have to stop and shelter for the night instead of what? Oh hey, look there's a fountain. <laughs> Random fountain just sitting there in the middle of absolute nowhere. But guys, I think what we're going to do is we're going to end it here and uh, continue our ex exploration mode um, in the next episode. and Continue down this road whilst it's getting dark. We won't be able to see. It's getting slippery. It's getting cold. Let's do that in the next episode. But if you've enjoyed today's episode, and I appreciate it's been a lot slower than normal, um, it would be great if you can hit that like button. And of course, if you're enjoying the series, please do hit the subscribe button. And for the love of God, comment. I want to hear what you have to say. If you've got anything you want to say, you tell me. You tell me. Bad, good, constructive feedback, whatever it is, let me know. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Love it. Love you. And from me... Peace out.